Alright, I'm going to show you how to crochet a snake. I'm using um, Red Heart Super Saver in Frosty Green. A small amount of black, which is actually optional. I'm going to be using it just for the nostrils. Um, a very small piece of red yarn, or you can also use red felt. I'm going to be using a hot glue gun for the felt or yarn. A size G hook or 4.25 millimeter hook. A yarn needle. Size 12 millimeter plastic safety eyes. And some polyfill. Alright, I'm going to start with the head. I'm going to be doing a magic circle. Alright, I'm going to be doing six single crochet in the magic circle. And you're going to do an increase in each stitch all the way around for a total of 12 in the round. Alright, then you're doing a single crochet and an increase all the way around for a total of 18 in the round. Do two single crochet and an increase all the way around for a total of 24 in the round. Alright, now you're going to do four rows with 24 single crochet in each row. Do two single crochet and a decrease all the way around for a total of 18 in the round. Do a single crochet and a decrease all the way around for a total of 12 in the round. Alright, I've added the 12 millimeter plastic safety eyes six rows down and five spaces apart. I've also stuffed the body. I'm going to be doing a decrease all the way around for a total of six. Do a slip stitch, chin one, break off your yarn. Alright, for the nose or the snout, I'm going to be doing a magic circle. I'm going to be doing eight single crochet in the magic circle. Alright, you're going to do three more rows with eight single crochet in each row. Do a slip stitch chain one, break off your yarn. Alright, for the body, I'm going to be doing six single crochet in the magic circle. Do an increase in each stitch all the way around for a total of 12 in the round. Do a single crochet and an increase all the way around for a total of 18 in the round. Alright, you're going to do 7 rows with 18 single crochet in each row. Alright, I'm going to do a single crochet and a decrease all the way around for a total of 12 in the round. Alright, I've stuffed the body, now I'm going to be doing a decrease all the way around for a total of 6. Do a slip stitch, chain 1, break off your yarn. 
Alright, for the tail, I'm going to be doing six single crochet in the magic circle. Alright, I'm going to be doing two more rounds with six single crochet in each round. Alright, now you're going to be doing a single crochet and an increase all the way around for a total of nine in the round. Alright, this is where you all get upset. I'm going to be doing four half double crochet. Do a chain one turn. Do four more half double crochet. Chain one turn. Now you're going to single crochet all the way around for a total of nine. Um, over the part where we had this chain one turn area, you're just going to be doing a decrease over it. Make sure you have nine single crochet total though. Or make sure you have nine stitches total. Alright, do two rounds with nine single crochet in each round. Alright, so I'm going to want to have this second bump on the opposite side of this side. So I'm going to be crocheting all the way around to about here so that I can center for half double crochet. For me that's going to be eight single crochet. Alright, so then you're going to do four half double crochet. Chain one turn. Four half double crochet. chain one turn and four more half double crochet all right so I'm going to crochet around for a total of 12 so over this part right here I'm going to be doing a large decrease just so that there's not a giant gap. Alright, I'm going to single crochet around for a total of 12 in the round. Alright, I'm going to do four half double crochet. In that last stitch there, I'm going to do a single crochet in the same stitch. So it's going to be an increase, but it has both the half double crochet and a single crochet. Um, then you're going to do three single crochet and an increase. Another three single crochet and an increase. All right, for this last round, I'm going to be doing four half double crochet. And then single crochet for the rest of the round for a total of 15 in the round. 
do a slip stitch, chain one, break off your yarn. Alright, so I'm going to work on the nose first. Before I sew it onto the head, I'm going to add the nostrils. I'm taking a piece of black yarn. I'm going to split it. So my yarn has four pieces of yarn. I'm going to split it so that I have one of the four pieces. I'm going to make a knot anywhere on the inside so that it can be hidden when I sew the nose on. Alright, so I'm going to sew the nostrils not on this part right here, but one in right here. Master of explaining things, sorry. Alright, so I'm one row in. I'm going to be going over one stitch. I'm going to be skipping. I'm going to be skipping this hole right here, going to the next one. And then going over this stitch right here. Alright, and then I'm going to tie another knot on the inside. Alright, I'm going to sew the nose onto the head. You can add the tongue whenever you want. For me it's easier, because I'm using a hot glue gun, for me it's easier to use it after everything is together so I know exactly where to add it. If you're going to try to um, sew it on, I would maybe do that before you sew the nose onto the head so that you can hide the knot better. Alright, I'm sewing the head onto the body. Alright, I'm going to sew the tail on to the body, the part where I have the last row with the half double crochet, that's going to be on top. And then just make sure that it's centered. So then all that's left is to add the tongue. For this one, I used a piece of felt and I just hot glued it right on in there. Um, for this one, I'm just going to use a piece of red yarn. I'm going to start with it pretty long just because um, I'm going to fray the end and I'm going to want room to be able to trim it. Alright, so I'm going to add some hot glue in the second row here. Um, shove this in off camera and I'll be right back. Alright, this is where I'm at. I'm just going to trim this a little bit. This is still longer than I want it to be. Now I'm going to try to split this into two. Alright. And I'm going to trim this again. Alright, and there you go.